Good afternoon, everyone. It's widowed mom raising two sons back with a massive, large Walmart grocery haul. This is my biggest, Coco, this is my biggest haul ever from Walmart. Um, I'm tired just from carrying it in, but I wanted to bring it to you. I did stock up. Um, I was running low on things and then with having gonna have a crazy week next week um, with my niece's wedding approaching and I just kind of wanted to stock up so that way I have things in the house and meals to prepare and Trenton um, he is not attending the wedding he has made the choice to um, stay home i have um two nice girls that are um tyler's age that are gonna come and stay um the weekend with trenton and he is just thrilled about that um trenton doesn't handle large gatherings well with his anxiety and i'm very proud of him for coming and communicating that to me and he's gonna have probably just as much fun is what we're gonna have. So I did kind of stock up on food items that, you know, the girls can make or Trenton, you know, <coughs> or that Trenton can make. So yeah, I'll just go ahead and get started because my counter is just packed full. I'll see if I can turn you around. Oh no, I have my pantry open, but there's my counter. So yes. I will just go ahead and get started. Uh, some mayonnaise. I was running low on mayonnaise, so I picked this up. I have two tomatoes. I am, my sister is having a gathering Saturday evening um, with ever you know, friends and family. And so I'm making taco salad. So I picked up two tomatoes. And I make my taco salad with French dressing. So I picked two of the French dressings up, the great values. And butter. I picked up two tubs of the Country Crock Original Butter. I'm gonna go to my phone over there. Some sour cream. I have a recipe that I want to make that requires sour cream and requires sliced mushrooms. Two of the big cans of the Mamwich Sloppy Joe mix. Ooh. And I have three. They did not have the milk I wanted. I always get the great value milk. So they substituted with the Prairie Farms. And they haven't had the one gallon or the um, the gallon jugs of great value milk at my Walmart for a couple weeks now. They've been substituting with um, half gallons. So that's what I'm just trying to move you around here since I don't have much counter space. And of course I stocked up on my sweet tea. I absolutely love this sweet tea the great value sweet tea from walmart so so good and i know some of you have wrote me and said you've tried it and you like it just as much as i do so yes there we go on that two bottles of the teriyaki sauce i'm gonna try to make um teriyaki chicken one night so yeah I needed some more teriyaki sauce. And another, something quick that I thought the girls could make um, while they're watching Trenton is I picked up two packages so I could, you know, we have it, is the Kraft Macaroni and Cheese. Who doesn't love Kraft Macaroni and Cheese? I know Trenton does. Loves, loves, loves. Two packages of the fully cooked bacon. My kids love this. If we have um, eggs for dinner or omelets, 
Josh was down last week and he made us all omelets and we had bacon with it and we had hash browns. So I picked up some more bacon. Ooh, I thought it was gonna fall. Summer, or, or it's not summer yet, but next Saturday it's summer. But um, I picked up three packages of the vanilla Great Value ice cream sandwiches. It's This is a great snack. And you know, it's, who doesn't like ice cream sandwiches? I picked up two cartons of eggs of the 18 count. Taco blend cheese to go in my taco salad that I'm making. And then I know I've got other cheeses here. And other shredded cheese to have on hand. Some shredded lettuce for my taco salad. And then Trenton likes to put shredded lettuce um, when he makes a lunch meat sandwich. So a bag for him. Four packages of the Great Value Mild Taco Seasoning to use for my taco salad. Package of meatballs. Three containers. I love cottage cheese. I got three containers of the Great Value Cottage Cheese. I think I'm going to run out of room. Package of buns. As a matter of fact, I have several packages of buns because I got brats. Um, these are hamburger. So I got hot dog buns and bread. So I have that all over there. And I also picked up two cases of the Great Value water. And I also picked up six, two liters of the um, Sam's Choice Cola. some grape jelly for the meatballs. Um, that recipe calls for barbecue sauce, meatballs, and a jar of grape jelly. I'm gonna try that. Um, my niece's soon-to-be mother-in-law made the meatballs at the bridal shower, and they were absolutely delicious, and I asked her for the recipe, and so I'm gonna make those. Two packages of the peony pasta. This is going to go with a chicken dish that I'm going to make in my crock pot that I need the mushrooms for and um, some other ingredients that I have. A thing of the cheeseburger macaroni. Hungry Jack original syrup. I'm going to be reaching guys so just bear with me. Some vegetable oil for cooking. Some trail mix. Snacks. I have, I want to try these. I've been getting those ones at the Dollar Tree, and my Dollar Tree haven't hasn't had them, so I thought I'd try these. It comes with peanuts, raisins, M and M's, milk chocolate candies, almonds, and cashews. So I picked one of those up to try to take to work and try. Two new sauces I tried. Um, this one is. This is from someone. Um, it's called Top Secret Recipes. It's burger special sauce. So I got a container of that for us to try. And then this is chicken sandwich sauce. And somebody said, or when I was reading about it, it said it's just as good as the um, Chick-fil-A sauce. Don't know if that's true, but I'll let you know. Two containers of the honey barbecue sauce. Ooh. I gotta reach, guys, sorry. I got several containers of potatoes, chicken broth, or no, potatoes, cream of chicken soup, because that's gonna go in one of the, re the chicken peony recipe I'm gonna make. Um, so I got like four, five, six, seven, eight of the cream of chickens to have. And then I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven of the um, potatoes. So, I'm just going to keep on going, guys. I picked up some 
egg noodles to have on hand. That goes with the peony pasta. I picked up four of the Jack's cheese pizzas. I figured this is something the girls could make um, for Trenton. Two packages of the Sun Chips. This was a substitution. I had the orange bag in my cart, um, but they didn't have them, so they gave me the two. So we'll see if the kids like those or not. Put those over there. Two boxes of the instant rice for when I make the teriyaki chicken. We'll have rice to go over it. I have two packages of the Ego butter milk uh, waffles. Trenton loves to have waffles, make himself waffles. I got two bags, excuse me guys, I'm gonna be reaching. Two bags of Doritos, and then I think I got a, two bags of the family size that I'm gonna use to make my taco salad. I might as well hit this bag up. This right here. This is my meat bag. I got a three pound uh, of meat. This is our ground beef. This is going to be for my taco salad. And then I got bratwurst. Um, Johnsonville brats, cheddar, and bacon. And then beer brats. So, got those. And then the cheddar and bacon. So we're gonna try those, see how those are. Okay, I'm gonna walk over here, guys. Walk over here, I hope you're all having a great, great day and things are going well for all of you. I got some Tennessee Pride um, sausage biscuits. And I got great value extra butter popcorn. Good deal. I spent about, I was going to look at my receipt and I forgot, about $297 on everything. I'm going to walk back over. Sorry guys, I just don't have a lot of room because of my grocery haul here. And here are the two bags of the family size Doritos that I will be making my taco salad with to take on Saturday to my sisters. So I got two packs. And then this was a substitution. I wanted a box of the chicken ramen noodles, but they didn't have them in a box, so they gave me 12 individual. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick them in a Dollar Tree basket that I have in my pantry. So I'm going to stick them in a basket like this so the kids can go to the pantry, pull them out, see what they are. Um, yeah, I, I just love these baskets from the Dollar Tree. I wish I would have got more when I saw them, but that's what I'm going to do is just store them right in there like that so it's easy to grab and for the kids to make. Okay, so I'm going to put these in the back of my pantry. Okay, I've still got more stuff, guys. More stuff. Coming with more stuff. I needed some powdered sugar. So I got powdered sugar. And then Trenton likes the shrimp ramen noodles, so I got a box of the shrimp. You get 12 in there. Then I got two packages of the three-pound chicken breast. Two or three pounds in each bag. And then my last two items, I think, finally... Ooh, this was a big haul. Then some no calorie sweetener. I put that in my sweet tea sometimes. And then this is my favorite, favorite coffee is the donut shop. 
um, in the great value is a great substitution for the real real deal i love this great value donut shop cop coffee it's medium blend i just i can't say enough about this coffee it is so so good i really like this coffee i drink it every single day so i think that's my walmart haul i didn't show you all my bread and buns but i have lots of bread and buns and i had two, like i said two cases of the water and I think I've showed you everything in my haul. Whew. But I did. I stocked up. I needed to stock up and, <clears throat> you know, get the pantries filled and, you know, get things for the kids and then get things, you know, for Trenton since, you know, we won't be here next weekend. Um, and I'm sure I'll do a, a little bit of a grocery haul next week. I did forget to order some lunch meat because I wanted to be sure the kids were gonna, you know, eat that up. So I need to get, so I will need to order a few things next week. But other than that, I'm pretty much stocked for the time being. So, and I know I have to get cereal. I, the kids quit eating it and then they go to eat it and we don't have any. So, and I had already placed my order and it had finalized. So I will be, you know, ordering a few things for next week to pick up. And I'll probably pick up on, Wednesday next week because Thursday I'm going in early um, to get my eight hours in and then I'm leaving early because we're getting uh, pedicures and manicures on Thursday and then Friday I took off because <coughs> we have the wedding rehearsal and everything so yeah but this was my Walmart haul I spent I want to say like $2.97 I'm, you know, I think that's what I spent, but I'm happy with everything I got, and I f feel good now that the pantry is going to be stocked again, and the cupboards are going to be stocked again, so yes, I hope you're all having a great, great week. I am, it's, you know, it's hectic at times, you know, I love my job, I love working full time, but, you know, you are tired when you get home and you're doing things. And, but I, I wouldn't give it up for the world. I absolutely love it. Love life right now. So thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you're new, please tap the subscribe button and then tap the bell so you get notifications when I post a video. So thank you all very, very much. I'll be back with a Dollar Tree haul. I don't know if I'll be back on over the weekend and if it'll be Sunday afternoon or Monday. Um, but I will, will have a Dollar Tree haul. So have a great evening, everyone. I'm just looking at the clock and I didn't realize it's almost six o'clock my time. So I'm going to get everything put away, put away nicely and probably go and tan. So have a great, great evening, everyone. Have a great weekend. If I don't chat with you before then, thanks for watching. I love you all, and thanks for all the support and love that you give to me and my family. So have a great evening, everyone, and take care. Bye-bye.